in this next series looking at relational database i'm going to be exploring what really is our relational database we're going to be looking at different types of relationships that may be established in a database along with how to create a relationship in microsoft access firstly relational databases so this is really well of course in a database the data the data is actually stored in tables and uh, with our modern databases with our electronic databases the tables are related in one way or the other and because of this it gives rise to the term relational database so a relational database is essentially a database that contains tables and uh, the tables are linked they are related in one way or the other uh, a relationship then in uh, a database essentially would speak to having two or more connections among tables in a database there are essentially three main types of relationships that can be created in a database uh, the first you're looking at here this is representing a one-to-one -one relationship notice that the well what you're looking at here this link between the two tables represents the relationship which should have been created and it is a situation where you have one field being linked to another field in another table so one field which is this field here the customer id field in the customer table being linked to this same field but in a different table which is the customer contact table the second type of relationship we have in a database is what is referred to as a one-to-many relationship and this now is where you have one record as depicted here one record being linked to multiple records in another table so it is one record in in a table being linked to multiple records in a different table now, an example of this now would be where for instance you may have a, a department and uh, there are so you have a you have a table let us say you have a table called department and you have another table called employees for each department so let's say that this is the accounting department you may have multiple employees in that one department in this case the accounting department and finally we have many to many relationships and uh, this now is where you have multiple records in one table being connected to multiple records in another table and uh, finally to create a relationship in microsoft access navigate to database tools click here that's relationships and then you need to select the tables that you're going to be using to create the relationships i'm going to be using this one here which is client listing click add and I'm also going to be selecting uh, survey listing and that's also close and then to create a relationship simply identify two common fields among the two tables and uh, drag from one drop to the other here I'm having a confirmation asking me if I want to create the relationship yes I want to create select create and that's it so this line here signifies that the relationship has been created between the both tables and that is essentially it so they are now linked and from here the database administrator can proceed now to do you know queries using the both tables all right that's it from me again here um please remember to check out the other videos in the series looking at how to use microsoft access i'm roger take care